Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to Homestead Arcana. My name is Jack Sims. The last one, we were just beginning to get into diving into the Miasma, and I think we're going to go ahead and do some more of that now, right now. Welcome, Abraham, to the Homestead. I have nothing to do with you. I need to grab some paper and go write some letters. We need to find someone to talk about some worldly mass to, so that means we need to send some letters. If you guys missed that last episode where we were going adventuring, go ahead and check that last one out. Video playlist should be in the top right corner. Go watch that and come back here and join us. Right, so this is gonna have been the first time. Ooh, wait, I see something in here. Is there actually a package right here? Oh, look at that. From Zeb. Hey, Jezebel. I bet you're having an exciting time, eh? I've never been one for the outdoors myself, but that's all right. Your little brother has little other plans in life. Speaking of which, I've sent over some blueprints for a wardrobe and some instructions on how to make a hat. I know fashion is more of my expertise, but I don't see why you can't expand your horizons a little. Think about it. No one's around for miles to judge your looks. It's the perfect time to experiment. Zeb. Wardrobe and uniform hat. Cool beans. Oh my god, we have three crows here. Let's see what we have. From Mon Pops. Hey kiddo, feeling better after taking a break from all that arcane energy. We all need to rest from time to time. Mod dug up a box of childhood drawings. I had a giant head of Huckleberry, uh, and extra- and a Huckleberry had extra legs. Another was just a purple cloud. You ever think kids can sometimes see things us adults can't? On second thought, forget it. It's probably nothing. Alright, let's grab that. From June Clerk. Jezebel, it's Principal Clerk. I was so proud to hear you were selected for the Ar Arcana program. Always a talented witch. I'm afraid I have ill tidings. The windstorms have been worsening and the schoolhouse sustained serious damage. We put classes on hold and if we don't get materials soon, I'm not sure we'll have a place to teach anymore. If you have anything to spare, we could use the help. Oh my god, there's another one there too. There's four of these little things. Little Rock Anonymous. Salutations, Jezebel. This is Little Rock Anonymous, a club that works with the citizens of Little Rock to ensure they receive goods not deemed necessary by town council. From time to time, we will send you a posting by one of our fine neighbors. Now, we don't have the funds for monetary or material compensation, but one of our members has Little Rock's oldest pattern book and will give out pages from it in return. You'll be learning our shared cultural heritage piece by piece. Interested? Here's one to get you started. Whoever said there's too much corn in our town is crazy. Not everyone has to like it, but they should at least try all the various ways it can be served. Which definitely refers to food. Let's check this last one. Thankfully, it's very short. From the council, Homesteader. The Little Rock storage stocks have showed a decline in stock and it is in need of refilling. The council will be paying double for the next seven days. Your patronage keeps Little Rock the greatest village among the clouds. Council of Little Rock. Cool. Alright. None of those were too super important, but being able to sell stock for double the price will be good. Shut what up, you talk about? Not a damn you thing. I wanted to harvest this thing, but you're in my way. Let me grab this cabbage. Let me grab that cabbage, since that's all done. And now I have a little bit of food to make. Uh, I'm going to make this, and then we'll go back to talking about masks. Alright, so now we've got some food. Uh, extra for... Oh, I've also learned a salad recipe now that I've done those. Um... We have that. I'd like to, I made that in preparation for going out since I got distracted. Uh, what do I need to do now? I need to figure out how to actually ask someone about making, or at least ask them about worldly packages, but I have no idea how to send a message myself. I've only received them. You know what, maybe, How's wait, it going? I ignored you, Huck, a moment ago, but what do you want to talk maybe about? you can tell me something about what do you want to talk sending about? messages? I gotta be honest. When it comes to these masks, I probably know about as much as you do. Oh, well, you're no help, Hop. I thought you Tilly were an I expert on this stuff. Kind of well, I can't ask I Tilly about them, them since, well, merchants. she's dead. Oh, right. This was way before your time. Really showing my age here. Huck, you can't have lived that there long. There was a time. You're just a cat. Where the miasma wasn't so high up. And again. Which meant that people could actually walk from town to town, selling their wares and such. Crazy, I know. Of course, not as crazy as a talking then, cat. Huck. That's about as crazy the safest thing as to be it could get the at times. One wrong turn, and you could end up in a miasma pocket. You know. So these masks were pretty popular with the traveling crowd. You know, back when there were travelers. And before they got banned. I know, I know. 
a Come on, life get to the point here. Accessory? Bam. Your, your life story of how these well, people got the mask. Blame Little Rock how do I on that. know more about them? Who, who can I find out more about ago. these masks from? What was his name? A century? Short Huck. silver people. How old is Huck? Stupid. Cats well, don't live that clever. long, not even in cat ears. Anyway. Someone found Pete dead out in the wild, and he was wearing a mask. The panic started building up, and the good citizens lobbied to get the mask ban. Yeah, that seems about as stupid no as all can be. No one ever knew how he died. The poor old Pete wasn't even found in the miasma. Could have died of a heart attack, for all we know. Well, that would have been more probable but, cause, you know, I suppose. Rock. They claim to be sun-fearing, but they're really just... Everything, everything feeling or fearing that's dumb better safe than sorry no that's dumb yeah. that's absolutely uh, to be dumb. fair these masks made a lot of people think they were more invincible than they actually were i don't think the academy intended these to be used by civilians i'd hope not anyway that's pretty much all i know well, all you know is pretty shit, Huck. That didn't help me for anything. I really thought that was going to be it. That would have been, like, real clutch if it had been. Oh, yeah. Fit check? Fit check? Look at that. Look at that. We snazzy as fuck, y'all. We snazzy as fuck. That shit gas. Cut. No, fuck. I got rid of all my wood. Oh, but it's very cheap. Okay, wait. Hold on. Let me go get wood. Let me go harvest out there real quick, like. Girl, please stop fucking moaning in my ear i don't want to eat that i want to eat that ass i'd like to eat that ass i suppose coming over here for apples how many apples oh my god we got five apples on the tree give me the app what the hell that apple looks like a worm's been fucking in it i fucking around in it not fucking i mean i'd hope it not fucking on my apples but you know what they probably are doing that anyway regardless of whether i want them to well now i can make my storage chest just one of them it takes 30 seconds but you know what i hope it let oh i can make black it didn't even come up with the recipe for this before i didn't even, i did not even realize i can make Okay, I definitely have to make this once the chest is done. I can absolutely get further into the miasma. I'm pretty sure there was a spot down there where there was some crystal that I needed to blast away. Oh my god, hell yeah. It's about to be morning. What's his face is about to show up? I could sell him a bunch of shit that they need and then just head out into the miasma. Oh, yep, there he is. Uh -huh, right out of the reading just to make sure. I read it earlier, but I just had to make sure. What have you got for me? A trellis and a birch made recliner? And some milk. Sadly for you, I'm not here to spend money and give you things. I'm here to uh, take your money and hopefully make enough to buy that. But for now, we're just going to do this. We're going to sell <coughs> literally, literally everything that I uh, have no use for. This lavender, gone. This cotton bowl, gone. Everything goes. You know, I wonder if Abraham could tell me about the masks. Like, he comes out here enough. Maybe he's heard a thing or two. Oh, I don't have enough for that spell. That's a shame. Okay. Uh, yeah, maybe he knows a thing or two. Abraham, do you happen? Nope, I clicked too fast. Morning. Do you have about anything what? to tell me yeah. about him? I noticed you wearing that mask. I clicked too fast, and, but uh, I clicked the right one. Going to places you probably shouldn't be going to. Uh, not really. Hey, now, I'd be safe I out there. I promised I wouldn't say anything. In fact, I might have something that may interest you. Abraham. It's an old academy manual with instructions on how to make your mask last longer in the miasma. I could do with something like that. But I can't give this away for free. It could be dangerous Gotta material. cost me? Abraham. I am still running buddies? business here. You understand. So until you can cough up 100 silver... It'll be sitting right here in my inventory. Oh, motherfucker, I got that <laughs> on me. I didn't even hear the last else. part. I don't care about the last part. I just want Morning. the book, Abraham. Give me the what book. Where is it? Mask augment. There it is. For 100 coin? Fuck yeah. Using the cauldron, make the mask augment. Fuck yeah. Tools. Mask augment. Requires two cotton bowl. Two lavender and a wild bat feather. Bat feather I literally just put in the chest. The lavender and cotton bowl I can just channel. Actually, wait, I might not even have to channel. Cotton, because I always keep that cotton. There we go. Mask augment. Consumable permanently increases your mask filter. And let's go ahead and consume it. And we get an extra two minutes there. All right. 
Uh, inventory is just food and potions. Let's put away the extra shit and head on in. All right, that's exactly where I was gonna blast through, but I didn't exactly get to make it through the area where we were the last time. So I'd like to go and do that. So let's go catch up over there. Holy shit, that just getting over here ran me down like all the way. There better not be any more hoppers. I just want to come and see. Oh, is that a... That's another wall of miasma, actually. Maybe there's a scar. Oh, look at that scar. I was really hoping. Nothing going to attack me here? Perfect. All right, let's close up this scar. Because now I should be able to explore just a little bit further. You must go back to Huckleberry now? Fuck that. I feel like I shouldn't really tell Huck much. I just feel like I should get information from him. I don't need to tell him shit. Wait, we just we just came up here, right? Wait. So we can keep going up that way even. We don't even have to go through that spot. But maybe the next time. I'm getting to the point in like exploration where I've really <laughs> like oh, most of my time is coming through this way and I have to make sure I watch my timer so that I can actually get back in time. Which it's not that it sucks. It just leaves less room for uh exploration. I can blow this. I mean, I'm, I mean, I have it. And the next time I get one, I can always just like bring it back to the short way. Right now we're trying to explore as far as we can, really. So, shadow charm. The keepsake must be kept in inventory to take effect. Makes the shadow spell easier to sustain for longer and those who own the symbols of the academy keep them hidden away. Is this the shadow charm recipe? Hell yeah, that might actually come in handy. I have no idea what it does, but definitely makes me feel better about opening that way instead of the closer one to the to the base that just brings me back around okay so this is this is a shortcut area okay nice nice let's just head through this way Hopefully not get attacked i gotta conserve this shit maybe i do need to start bringing uh some of those uh beverages with us so that i can use this more freely and not have to like just continuously toggle it on and off. What's that? Never mind, I don't really care what it is. Not 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 too much interested when there's a whatever that little demon uh spawn is in its hole. What do we got? We got cotton seedling. There's a journal, Academy Orientation. Salutations recruit, sun blessed the road that brought you to our doors. The Academy has been a bastion of scientific projects for centuries mission to understand the mysteries of the miasma thanks to the revelation in miasmic trick half-life identification by academy founder we all need creeks we confirm that the explosion of miasma occurred 1800 years ago henceforth ab after boom for timekeeping founded in 1774 ab the academy has never relented in its pursuit of uncovering the truth now it's your turn to join us while you may be thrilled at the chance to journey into miasma make no mistake it's just as mysterious awe-inspiring and dangerous as tales told in our youth. You will start your training after being assigned to one of the academy chapters spread throughout the highlands. With your help, we will discover the secrets to the miasma. Welcome home, scholar. I am in fact a scholar of the miasmetric arts, and I am exploring. Oh shit! I just got a free shadow spell potion. Look at that. Uh, transforms the caster into a figure of shadow, making them undetectable to new eyes. Will not fool those who already had their eyes. Oh, there's sights on the caster. Matilda Gardner wrote this spell with the help of her familiar. Oh, so Matilda and Huck had a uh, hand in that spell. Nice. After many moons melt to collagens, I think I figured out how to craft a variation of the shadow spell that will cover me from head to toe. Huck was the one who suggested the use of tomatoes with their innate protective properties. I suppose it would make sense that he would know how to disappear better than anyone else. Cats do like to know how to disappear very well. The spell had its flaws. However, I tried casting while in the sights of a feathered bat and it was able to perceive me as if nothing had changed. Regardless, progress is progress. Aunt Matilda made this? Must be fairly powerful then. That's what I was thinking. Especially if she made it with Huck. Don't, I don't trust Huck all that much. He might, he's still good for the information that he might give. I can't go this way. Unfortunate. I definitely need to start heading back and that shortcut would help me. Um, but that, I lost my train of thought. I'm gonna head back. I can't explore any further without like probably dying okay i made it out my me as my items are freed let huck know what happened okay it worked a second time i do dislike That's the great. fact that um now that i only had like really four minutes miasma, out there it took me about a minute and a half to get back i should have gave myself more time being as i started taking damage by the end to be made around these parts but 
I don't know if you can still find it. What do you mean? I, I literally already have tomato huck. Scar fertilizer mark three recipe. What are we just gonna we're just gonna skip the mark two like it doesn't even exist? I mean, f f fine by me. The more powerful, the better, I suppose. But what is a more powerful one gonna do? Considering it already breaks down and lets me explore. What could a Mark III do? Oh my god, that is a huge fucking shadow charm. Why is it so fucking big for? That's so much of my inventory space if I'm gonna go out and have to be able to use it. Okay, I cannot channel any of these plants anymore, but now we have a much larger garden. I can use, you know what, let, well, I fe feel like the scar fertilizer, no? Wait, where's the Mark III? Can I not make a Mark III? It said it gave me the recipe for a Mark III. It's not in my inventory. This is my shadow spell potion. Do I just make the one like they say? Make a new scar fertilizer that I'm gonna have to make room for in a moment? Oh, holy shit, I can make another blasting. You know what, fuck it. I might as well make another blasting powder. All right, go ahead, make that. And let me grab my fur to lot. Oh, hell. Uh, stupid ass. Here, you can go there and you can get put into my inventory in that spot. Okay. So many big items. So many, so many big items. Grow the third dust eater. Okay, so that's next. Abraham. I'm coming to you with shit to sell, my boy. Abraham. Let me shop with you. Yeah? Date sugar. Ooh, I could buy date sugar. It's used for crafting. I could... Also buy a bucket. I don't need the bucket. I could buy linen. What do you got? I don't know what any of that's used for. I literally haven't seen any recipes for any of that, so I'm not gonna bother for now. Actually, wait. This is only stuff. I think I had. I'll have to wait for it to come back around if I don't buy it today. I think. I wonder. I, do I even have enough money for that? I will not have it. Well, mm, I literally just barely have enough if I want to be able to switch off into that potion. What if I just be careful? You know what? I don't need it right now. I'm just going to be careful. We'll, we'll call it like that. I'll just be careful. I'm not going to spend my money. It's so expensive just to be able to make a house here. So I'm not going to do it. Not going to do it. Not going to do it. In fact, what I am going to go do is end this episode here, guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to smack that like button. Drop a comment down below. Subscribe to the channel and turn on that bell notification so you guys do not miss when the next episode goes out. And as always, I hope you all enjoy the rest of your day. And I will see you next time. Peace.